I am Anil Kumar. In this video, we will learn how to find equation of a tangent line to a circle at a given point. It is part of pre-calculus. I hope this will help you to remember the concepts which you have already learned. The equation of the circle is given to us as x minus 1 whole square plus y plus 2 whole square equals to 25. It really means that the center of the circle is at 1 minus 2, right? So you can think about uh, the circle like this. Let, let me just sketch one here. The center has been translated to 1 minus 2 somewhere there. The radius is 5. So, so with that as kind of a circle, I mean, it's what we will do. So I'm just making a rough sketch. Okay, okay that's fine. So let's say this is our circle center. And the point given to us is 5, 1. So we are saying this point here is x value of 1 and y value of minus 2. The point on the circle is given at 5, 1. So, so from, and the radius is 5. So that means uh, 5, 1 will be somewhere here. Okay. We need to find equation of a tangent line. So it'd be kind of like this. Is it okay? So I hope this sketch gives you an idea of uh, what the situation is. To find the equation of the tangent line, we need to connect the center, let's say the center is C, with the point P. Is it okay? And once you do that, we can find slope of this line CP. Slope of tangent will be negative reciprocal. We already know a point on the circle, which is also on the tangent, which is 5, 1. And then I think it should be simple to find the equation of the tangent line. So I hope with this you understand the whole concept, right? So once that is clear, let's begin. How to find equation of tangent line? So first thing is we identify what center is. Center is at 1 minus 2. And the point P given to us is 5, 1. So using center C and the point P, we can find slope let's call this mcp slope of mcp will be the formula is y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1 that gives me 1 so these are the two points right so 1 minus 1 minus minus 2 divided by 5 minus 1 right 5 minus 1 that makes it 3 and this is 4 now let the slope of tangent line be mt, right, so mt. Now since this is perpendicular, it's going to be negative reciprocal, right, so negative 4 over 3. Does it make sense to you, correct? So since it is perpendicular, right? Correct. Now if the slope of the line is minus 4 over 3, then the equation could be y equals to minus 4 over 3x plus b. To find the value of b, we can use the point 5, 1. x value is 5, y is 1. So we get 1 equals to minus 4 over 3 times 5 plus b. Taking it to the right side, this becomes 20 over 3, right? So we get 1 plus 20 over 3 equals to b. So if you take common denominator, right, 3, so you get 3 plus 20 equals to B, which is 23 over 3. Is that okay? So once we know the value of B, we can easily write down the equation of the tangent line. Substituting this here, we get Y equals to minus 4 over 3, X plus 23 over 3, all right? If the question is to write this in standard form, you should know that technique also. We just need to uh, bring all the terms on one side. We can multiply by 3, so we get 3y equals to minus 4x plus 23. Bringing them to the left side, we want to keep coefficient of x positive, right? So we get 4x 
plus 3y minus 23 equals to 0, right? So you could write answer in standard form or in slope intercept form if it is not given or specified in the equation. But I hope with this you understand the process of finding equation of tangent line to circle at a given point. I'm Anil Kumar and I hope that helps. You can put some likes if you like my video. Share my videos with your friends and don't forget to write comments. Thank you and all the best.